did you actually come about doing what you do? Uh, you know, weirdly to say, I probably started in second grade. <laughs> so <laughs> my journey started back when I was little. Um, I was told uh, I had asked, okay. So I was a bit competitive when it came to grades and there's a little boy in class, his name is Scotty. And Scotty and I used to compete for the top grades in the class. And, um, you know, we would one up each other on like spelling tests and things like that. And uh, Scotty would disappear once a day. And I was like, what, you know, where is he going? Well, I finally asked him and he very proudly told me to the computer room and how, you know, only the smart kids get to go. So of course I ran up to the teacher saying, well, I wanna go to the computer room also. And she goes, no, the, you, you don't, you really don't. And she's like, go outside and play with the other, you know, with the other girls. Um, the, uh, unknowns to me, all the boys were starting to be trained on computer systems and the girls were being sent out uh, to go play in the playground. So I asked enough that uh, I finally asked her one day, I said, well, can I just go to the library then? So I went to the library and I checked out every book that I could find on computers because I wanted to understand why I couldn't understand them. So I had a stack of books higher than my head and I came home. My mom's like, what is this? And I said, well, I need to understand why I don't, I don't understand this. And I went to my room and she, you know, wasn't paying attention. So I just remember putting all the books down, reading them, devouring them. And, um, I will tell you, I, I still didn't understand why I couldn't understand them. And uh, my freshman year of high school, I was finally given the opportunity to take a computer class. And I was the only girl there. And I was a cheerleader on top of that. So pretty much every day there was a game and I would have my little cheerleading outfit on and all the boys. And it was nice to get a lot of help <laughs> on coding because here they'd all been coding classes for years and it was my first year starting. And um, it, you know, it really uh, sparked a career for me in technology. But again, even for my, um, for my first degree in business, I went business instead of technology because again, you know, females were not really accepted in the arena and it was just really rare. Um, and I was told, oh, you'll, you'll make a great, you know, C COO, you'll make a great lawyer, you'll make a great, I was given kind of the list and technology was never on that list. Even when I took those tests we used to take in high school as to what career should you have. It was always something that, you know, it was business, but um, definitely not doing what I do today.